Wait, don't. Wait, don't do it. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. What's going on, guys? What's going on? We're uh, headed to the gas station right now. We're going to show you guys how we measure E85 content because a lot of people have been asking. And uh, now I'm going to show you guys how to do it. Here we are. E85. E85. Don't shoot my card. All right, so in order to test your E85 content, you want to get a little EA5 tester. I got this on Amazon. I'll throw a link down in the description. And pretty much what you're going to want to do is fill it up to the line with water and then fill the rest with the E85. In order to get the E85 in there, we're going to put some in this little cup and we're going to syringe it into the vial. Now that we got the E85 in the cup, take our little syringe here. Obviously, if you have an E85 analyzer, this would be a lot easier, but this is the budget way. Man, that's perfect. Put the cap on, mix it a little bit, and then let it sit for a few minutes. For a few minutes? Yeah. So as you can see, this gas pump, this fuel pump is pumping out E70. 70% ethanol. So what we're gonna do with that information, I'll show you right now. Yeah, there you are. Okay, so we're gonna open up our little calculator right here. I'll uh, put a link down in the description for this as well. We're gonna type in 70% for the ethanol. And we're gonna put about eight gallons maybe. And then for the regular gas, do seven, which is 93 octane. And it has a 10% ethanol content. So that's going to be equal to 15 gallons or E42. So I want it to be E50, so I'm going to add a little bit more E85, maybe nine. Fuck. <laughs> nine gallons. Six gallons of 93. E46, that's close. Hey. Ah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> E49, I got approximately 30 miles left in my tank, so that should be enough right there. So we'll do 10 gallons of E85, and then 5.5 gallons of 93, and that'll equal to an E49, which is close enough.